Thank you, thank you. I'm an acupressurist, and as an acupressurist, I work with individuals with their bodies to help those bodies be in a state of flow where the energy is moving, because energy does not like being stuck. My name is Deborah Myers. My business name is Health at Your Fingertips. But one of the things I've been doing recently is discovering how much the children in our lives want to also be in balance. Through the years, I've developed a whole series of workshops because I believe each and every one of us has the ability to connect with our very own energy and make a difference. We just need to know a technique. We need to know how we can do it, how to connect with this energy that runs through our bodies. And guess what? We can do it with our fingertips. Thus, health at your fingertips. Through the years, I've discovered that a number of my clients and, and um, students happen to be elementary school teachers and middle school teachers. And they were taking what I was teaching them into the classroom and sharing the information with their students and discovering the huge benefits that were taking place. They were noticing improved clarity and focus. They were noticing that state of grounding, of being there, of not being all over the map. Their classrooms were there and they were there with concentration and wanting to be there, wanting to learn, wanting to experience. As that all transpired, two years ago, I had the opportunity to be working with one of my clients who's an elementary school teacher and she was talking about doing this self-help energy flow that I call the daily clean your house flow. And she was commenting that there would be no way that she would ever miss a day. She's a third grade teacher. No way that she would ever skip a day to have her kids enjoy this. And I said, why? And she looked at me like, I said, why? And she started stouting out all these benefits. I said, what would you think if it was a real program? Because just then she was just leading them through it. She said, what do you have in mind? So I just, just started describing. And what came out was an animated video. The results is an animated video project with this being one of the caricatures. Recognize that this body has a house on it. Our bodies are our houses. And if we clean them out every day, we are ahead of the game. If we actually do a really good vacuuming and get rid of the dust bunnies and cobwebs, we are ready for the next day, for everything we're gonna ask our bodies to do. And when we put it that way, we're also helping our bodies be better prepared for whatever might come at them. So imagine a classroom, and just go ahead and do this for a moment. Starting their day, just giving themselves a hug that's basically what they're doing. Light, gentle touch, anywhere from your elbows on up, you're giving yourself a hug. But as an energy balance point, it's connecting with an area of the body that's all about lung and diaphragm breath. It also connects with all these energy balance points throughout your back to drop your shoulders, elongate your spine, give you space to be. The next step in the daily clean your house flow is just sitting on your hands, with your hands about at the outside of your thighs. And that one's all about vitality. Okay, yes. Because <laughs> when you bring breath into the body, the next step is to bring it to every cell of your being, creating vitality throughout. So think about that. Those are only the first two steps. You feel it already? And you'll also discover, if you go to dailycleanyourhouseflow.com, the first 90 seconds of the animated video that teachers, parents, and kids are absolutely loving. So those are just the first two steps. What we do when we do our daily clean your house flow is help pump up our system, help revitalize, help give everything clarity and focus, expand breath, enjoy our emotions. Hear that? Enjoy our emotions. Let our feelings give us information because that's the purpose of emotion. So I want to tell you some stories of why this works. So, not too long ago, I happened to meet up with an 11-year-old who was in fourth, fifth grade. He had just gone through a classroom experience for the whole year with his teacher. She was part of the pilot program. So he'd been doing the daily clean your house flow every day. And her, his mom had also recognized the extreme benefit of it and decided to get it for the home. I had both a family kit and a classroom kit. And as they were 
doing this, it was making a big difference. So my, so this little guy standing there with his mom in line at a store, she knows me, she bends down, she goes, Joey, this is Deborah. she's the one that did the Daily Clean Your House Low video. And he goes, that's you? And I go, yeah, do you like it? He goes, oh, I love it. I said, really, how often do you do it? He goes, well, every day, <laughs> like, duh. I said, good, and why? And then it was really puzzled look. Well, why? And I said, why have you decided it's so important to do this? And he said, he looks down, he says, well, I'm studying together, so I'm getting better grades. Right, Mom? <laughs> he goes, I'm no longer sick, so I'm not missing any school. Then he goes, and me and my brother are really getting along good. Now, that's crazy. <laughs> and then he proceeds to say, and I'm playing a better game of soccer, so why wouldn't I do it? Out of the mouth of a young man comes all, so many reasons of why we need to do our energy work. It's all about recognizing that you are a vital energetic be being. And if something isn't vital about it, it just means it's stuck, blocked energy. And all you need to do is remind it to move. So when you do the daily clean your house flow and add in any other energy balance points that I teach in my classes, you would really get the idea of that. Here's a quote from a young woman, 16 years old, who's been working with me for a few years, has taken several of my workshops. She's getting ready to take off for college because she's graduating early. She's one smart kid. She goes, I can't imagine not doing the daily clean your house flow. It helps each day go so smoothly. I sleep better and I start the day rested. Studying is easier and I have no anxiety over tests. And any time I have feelings that come up that I don't understand, I just jumper cable and I feel better. Wow. Now, jumper cable is the last step of the daily clean your house flow. And that's one I'm going to share with you right now. So as you're sitting there finishing up listening to me, just take a moment, a couple good breaths, and what you're going to do is hold gently cupping each thumb and finger, one at a time. Couple good breaths, starting with the thumb. And then you're gonna do each finger. So it might take you a, a couple minutes. And as you're doing this, you're balancing all the emotion, all the physical energy. You're balancing all the energy that comes in and out of your body. You're also helping to balance all the emotion. What irritates me to no end is how many of our children are in a state of stress. Isn't that terrible? Now, let's face it, stress is out there in that world. We can't get away from it. It's part of our life. But wouldn't it be better to walk around in a body that's no longer reacting to the stress? This acupressure technique can so easily connect with that so it doesn't become a part of the bodies we walk around in. And I want to share with you that we are some of the best models that our children have. And if we're modeling stressful behavior, we are not doing them any justice. We are not taking care of our kids. And if that's the case, we need to show them how better we can be in our bodies. So showing them something like the daily clean your house flow and other ways of taking care of ourselves is so important. So I want you to recognize, number one, how passionate I am about this and how important it is for me to share with you the possibilities. So if you have any organizations any conferences, any events, any schools you would like me to connect with. I want to get this out there in the world. It is so, so important that these kids enjoy their lives and understand how easy it, li it is to live in a very comfortable, happy, healthy body. So as you continue doing your jumper cables, recognize that one of the biggest things you're doing is you're getting rid of worry fast. You're getting rid of worry when you hold your thumb. You're getting rid of F, the fear. Getting rid of worry fast, F, the fear. You're getting rid of anger and frustration for the A. You're getting rid of sadness, and you're getting rid of the trying to's. Trying too hard, trying too much, trying to do it all. That place of efforting that's no longer a verb when it becomes a description of how you are. And that's stress. No more stress.